Hi guys, I'm Juju Astro Barbie, Fairy of Love, and this is Angel. Hello, say hello. We send you a lot of love, lots of joy, and lots of mm -hmm, kisses. Welcome to your weekly horoscope. This week, the sun is in the sign of love and peace, Libra. And it's a good thing. So happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you, Libra. You are the beauties of the zodiac and we love you for it. Mwah! Well, this week is sort of unusual. The moon will travel in the sign of Sagittarius, Capricorn, Aquarius, and also Pisces. Remember, when the moon is in your sign, you shine. This week, it's sort of an edgy Mercury. Mercury is the planet of communication. It could bring us like ups and downs because it will be hit by a few planets, making all communications in our personal life, collectively, in the news, pretty tricky and very unexpected, like unpredictable. It's very important to take control of our thoughts because our thinking could become pretty serious, grounded, rigid, but also uh, on Monday, this is one of the days that we really need to be careful. Monday and Friday actually. The rest of the week too, but these are the ones that we need to tread nicely and diplomatically in anything we do. Mercury Monday, close to Venus, planet of love, in the sign of Scorpio. You know Venus does not like to be in Scorpio, especially retrograde, are you kidding me? So it pushes us though, in a very good way, to dig deep, to get to the bottom of some problems, of things that deals with relationship, partnership, and finances. If you don't want to deal with it, you'll have to, trust me, the universe will force you one way or the other. So just go for it and accept it all. Do not resist because the success awaits for the people who do and liberation too. On Friday, another delicate day, Mercury, planet of communication, will bring, well, mixed messages. It's sort of like sunny, but a little clouds. It makes a beautiful trine with Neptune, planet of dreams, but a square with Mars, planet of energy, and also our sexuality and the way we really control our relationship. So it's a day that will bring a mixture of love, inspiration, attraction, desire, but also anger, impulsiveness, confusion, insecurity. So this day, diplomacy, kindness, Silent power is the key to success, peace of mind, health, and happiness. Okay? You do this and everything's gonna be okay. So it's sort of a weird week altogether with a sense of adventure, but the universe truly, truly put in the wings under our wings to fly higher, or for some of us to even push us out of the plane of our comfort zone in order to fly better in a better place. Okay? But it's all good. Just surrender to the universe because the universe is you being you, right? Happy Saturday, Will. The weekend is here. Yuppie. Happy, happy moon in Sagittarius. Smiling at Mars, planet of energy, and the sun, planet of life. But making a square with Neptune, the planet of dreams, of aspirations, bring us actually a fun Saturday. Because this whole little square with Neptune just makes us grounded and makes us also serious and irresponsible in our relationship. It gives us a, also a sense of adventure to do something differently. So let's enjoy life to the fullest today and share our blessings, our talents with our loved ones, okay? Generosity of heart and kindness today pays off big time. The time of the day, my intuition knows what my body needs and I always follow my intuition. Libra, Libra, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Libra, we love you. You are the cutest son of the zodiac. Do you know that? And good years are ahead for you. The stars that this week bring you closer to home and family and friends. A good time to really clean up your life, organize and rethink your strategies at work and career and finances. Time also to really go slow. Do not rush into anything and also make peace with friends and neighbors of Somebody you had a little feud with in the in the past, eh, forgive, forget, okay? And have a talk with them. You get also brilliant ideas and how to increase your money, your income. 
this week you're gonna get inspiration about that on the weekend you should ask because you will receive your magical color lilac lucky numbers 5 and 12 Ta-da! Scorpio the tiger in you my beautiful Scorpio is really oh, take initiative and now's your time to reinvent yourself in everything and manifest your dreams take care of your appearance of your health are you in perfect shape this is the week to take the bull by the horn and do it. Everything is really, really going a little fast, and, but you are definitely heading in the right direction. You don't have a choice, really. A chance meeting could also grow into a meaningful relationship. If you're a bachelor or if you're married, your whole love life is taking a whole new color. In career and in romance, also, you feel more in charge of your destiny. On the weekend, pampering yourself is what you need, okay? A massage, making love, you know, do go shopping and buy yourself something. Your magical color red, lucky numbers, 7 and 42. Ta-da! Sagittarius, you have really good ideas this year. You're super brilliant. And you also have good luck in financial matter and you are getting things done. There may have been some changes of plans in the last couple of weeks, but now it's starting to become more in the flow. Of course, Mercury is going a little crazy, so you still have to watch what you say and be diplomatic in everything you do. Appreciate also your blessings. A good time to make investments and to take care of your budget, to tell people what to do with a smile. Your creativity is very, 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 very strong, So, and your determination to succeed and make things happen is very high. So I think success is definitely part of your week. In love, definitely ask yourself, is it real? Is it good? Is it good for me? Is it love because of me or because of my wallet or because of my sex appeal or is it because of my soul too? If it's not, walk away. All right, start over. You're allowed. Your magical color orange, lucky numbers, 4 and 48. ta -da. Capricorn, yes. You're eager to succeed and make things happen. You want to be happy. Why not? You are physically and emotionally very alert. The focus is definitely on freedom of action, more also ability to manifest what you want and to see into the possibility of your future. In career, dress for success. In love, you're very popular. You should definitely ask and you shall receive. A discussion also about philosophy or the occult could bring some wonderful answers, especially after Tuesday. On the weekend, go act. You can meet exciting people and maybe new friends if you're married or definitely fall in love if you're single. Your magical color green, lucky numbers 2 and 28. Aquarius, you could be a little sensitive but inspired. The stars and Venus and Mercury and Uranus definitely give you a big boost in your career and ambition sector. It's very important to let go of the past, make a fresh start, think new, innovation. In love, you definitely get a green light, more peace of mind. It's very important if you're single to believe in yourself, okay? Show also a positive attitude and if you do, the world will be yours. On the weekend, get in touch with your spiritual self. Okay, go deep inside here for answers and questions. Leos, Cancers, Virgos are true friends. Your magical color violet, lucky numbers, 3 and 21. Hello. Spicy, spices, my little dolphins and mermaids. Well, stars make you very creative, but also sensitive, but also optimistic. The masculine and the feminine side of you inside and outside are very much in zinc and it feels good. More harmony within and the ability to express both of them equally. In career, take initiative. You have the tools and the power to materialize your dreams. Negotiate with the powers that be what you want and maybe help them to think even bigger. Increase your revenues. Expect gains in the next few months. A special friend could lend a hand when needed, and somehow another friend could make your life even more magical. In love, romance is in the air. All you need to do is show up and say, yes, I want to love, and enjoy it all the way. Cancers, Taurus, and Virgos believe in you. On the weekend, share your feelings, open your heart, take a risk. You won't be sorry. Your magical color blue, lucky numbers, 2 and 11. Ta-da! Aries, it can be a sensitive time for you. Somehow you're, t you're trying to really, really take care of your life and become the master, but sometimes it's not easy, but continue to do it. You fall, you pick up, you fall, you pick up. At work, you accomplish 
more than expected. Handle things one at a time. Don't do two or three things. Relatives also and friends support you in everything you do, especially in the domestic front. You could also get some visit from somebody from abroad or maybe see an old friend. And I think you should because it will bring back good memories. On the weekend, you receive appreciation from a loved one and it feels good. Your magical color red, lucky number six in 33. Ta da! Taurus, you feel stronger. Stars bring ambition and new visions about your future. You have all kinds of ideas, that's good. This week, not a good idea to start anything though. Have faith in yourself. You are definitely protected by the stars and you also have a natural wisdom and creativity that is very strong. So use all these things to make things happen. It's not about what you really want this week. It's really more about what you really need. Don't confuse the two. What do you really need that makes you really happy and satisfied? Everything else, throw out in the ocean. In romance, you are definitely feeling really appreciated by your friends, your family, and your lover. If you're single, you should go out and on the weekend, pamper yourself. Also, tenderness awaits, especially on the weekend. It's like you'll feel really, really loved and appreciated. Taurus, other Taurus, Pisces and Cancer show they care. Your magical color turquoise, lucky numbers, 2 and 11, ta -da. Geminis, this is an empowering week. You're doing better and better. You have responsibilities, but you handle them very nicely. You attract new important people that could really help you put yourself in the map or get a project going. The focus is on special projects, shared resources, PR, also to be patient with people, partnerships, to listen to the other people, what they have to say. The occult also brings a lot of answers about your life's purpose. Libra, Leo and Cancer really inspire you. And on the weekend, take note of your dreams. They really are prophetic. Your magical color yellow, lucky numbers, three and 21, ta-da. Cancer, your charisma is magical. People are absolutely impressed by your wit, your charm, your sex appeal, and your uniqueness. In career, you are definitely moving in the right direction. A lot of surprises just out of the blue. So, and when it happens, just go right in. In love, romance is in the air. You feel loved. You're very, very sincere in your approach. And people really appreciate your joie de vivre and your beautiful generosity of the heart. You may have the urge to travel or to do something differently. Hey, why don't you do something about it? Whatever makes your life exciting, do something about it. Be daring. Be the best you can be. It's now or never. On the weekend, you really feel good about yourself and it, everybody gives you compliments. You go like, wow. Your magical color pink, lucky numbers, 4 and 13. Leo, you may feel a little sensitive, but very strong and very brave to really meet all challenges with power and dignity and the bless. At work and in love, you're definitely wearing your crown more than ever, way better than the last couple of months. Helping other people is very, very rewarding. And at home, share with your family and loved ones what you need, okay? This is the time to talk and share. A friend can surprise you with a beautiful something. And on the weekend, somehow memories from the past could reconnect you with people from the past in a positive way. Your magical color is turquoise, lucky numbers three and six. And also Virgos, Cancers, and Aquarius play a key role in your life this week. Virgo, Virgo, you're very popular this week. People appreciate you, your mind, your sensitivity, your good heart. And Mercury, your ruler, that's going a little crazy this week, could bring some deep emotions, some sensitivity. But actually, it serves you well because it forces you to think about things about you. A social event could bring excitement into your life. If you are invited, go. You will learn something and get something out of it. Also, if you have been too soft with friends, co-workers, or a loved one lately, well, maybe it's time for you to affirm yourself, put your foot down and say, no more, enough is enough. And Cancer, Leo, and also another Virgo play a key role this week. Your magical color is turquoise, lucky numbers, nine and 18, ta -da. And now here's your wizard affirmation of this, well, let's put it this way, challenging week, but we learned a lot from it. Eleanor Roosevelt said, no one can hurt or disrespect you unless you give them permission. This is my favorite, it's so true. 
Remember that what people do and say, it's all about them. When someone offers you some nice compliments and nice thoughts, you take it. When they don't, it's negative, criticism, just say bye, see you later, alligator. So have an exciting week. Learn everything you need to learn about yourself because you will. Thank you for all your love, your support, your clicks, your likes. I love it, I love it, I love it. Be good now.